Hey guys, I hope all of you are fine. Welcome back to my channel with another beautiful collection of beautiful, trendy and amazing ideas of neckline embroidery ideas. The basic content and the main feature of this video is borderline embroidery ideas and the very beautiful and creative, funky, stylish designer style patterns of how you can use a borderline embroidery to different variations like side corner, like corners of your front shirt, corners of your sto stroller, scarf, dupatta and even you can make these very beautiful patterns of borderline embroidery onto your DIY home decor items like you can make these very beautiful patterns onto your I'll, first of all we will talk about the dressing things uh, the clothing styles like dupattas and sari pallus, scarf, shawls and different type of stylish patterns of shirts and for DIY of home based items you can make these patterns of very beautiful floral patterns onto your pillow covers, onto your cushion covers, onto your butt sheets, table cloth and many more creativities as per your choices. Before going into the further details that which type of embroidery patterns, which type of embroidery stitches, what type of embroidery materials are being required to make these very beautiful patterns of hand embroidery, I have a simple request to you that if you are new to my channel or you haven't subscribed my channel or you are watching my video for the very first time, then please, please, please don't forget to subscribe my channel and by subscribing, press the bell icon so that you could remain notified with the latest updates and uploads on my channel. Guys, one more request that we never claim to reclaim someone else's work as our own. The basic purpose, the basic motive and main intent of making videos and sharing the beautiful design ideas with you is to share some creative DIY and funky ideas, not to reclaim someone else's work as our own. So keep showering your love, keep supporting us, keep loving us, keep watching our videos as you always have been so that we could grow up into a large and a remarkable YouTube friends and family members. And guys, now let's uh, get back to our main concern that how you can use these for different types of stylized patterns. If you want to give a 3D look, then I would recommend you to use wool for embroidering these patterns. If you want to give a sleek and beautiful, uh, unique look uh, by giving a touch of decency, then I would recommend you to use anchor and DMC. So different type of threads along with the thickness of thread you can use any type of needle and uh, can enjoy the embroidery pattern guys the beauty and creativity of these patterns is that simple and easy beginner friendly hand embroidery stitches have been used to make the whole embroidery pattern so keep following these and one more important advice that i would recommend you to use the same color fabric base which is being used in these designs and same color of threads to give uh, exactly look alike a touch because changing the color combination could result in variation which will lead towards your less liking or the choice is yours so keep focusing and keep watching our video and content very soon we will be sharing 5d and 7d new trendy Patterns of hand embroidery that are hard to believe that it is a work of hand embroidery and hand art. So all of them are very unique. So stay tuned and stay connected. We will be sharing soon.